Did Diane Keaton ever act in a movie with Jack Nicholson? Absolutely. Diane Keaton and Jack Nicholson shared the screen in a romantic comedy that, in many ways, laughed in the face of ageism, at least for a couple of hours. The film I'm talking about is Something's Gotta Give Asterisk, written and directed by Nancy Myers. There's something about Myers films where you just get spectacular homes and a crisp white aesthetic that makes you want to remodel your entire living space. But I digress. In the film, Keaton plays a successful playwright named Erica Berry, and Nicholson is Harry Sanborn, a forever bachelor who happens to date younger women, like from the demographic that still gets carded at bars. Here's the kicker. He has a heart attack while at her beach house, and that's where their stories collide. The dynamics between the two are electric. They're like a pair of old-school, high-voltage cables sparking off one another. It's Nicholson and Keaton, come on, it was practically guaranteed to be screen magic. Their chemistry is that of fine wine, perhaps buried in a cellar and aged just right. It's that mature, nuanced flavor profile. Not that I'm a wine connoisseur, but I know what I like. And Portland, teeming with its vineyards and breweries, no doubt understands the value of maturing gracefully, something both of these actors do splendidly. Fun fact, Keaton got an Oscar nomination for her role in the film. Watching her go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Nicholson is like witnessing a masterclass in acting from both. They just slip into their characters like they were tailored for them. And isn't that what's great about these performances? They really allow talent to shine regardless of age. Check the film out if you haven't. It's not just a showcase of acting prowess, but also a reminder that love doesn't check your ID at the door. Sometimes it just saunters in and makes itself at home.